So it's ten past eight and he's dressed now. No socks on because it's cold today. I'm keeping him warm close to me for a bit, we're just having a cuddle. We've both had breakfast <laughs> and he's been changed and then I'll go upstairs in a bit and put him down for a nap and then I can get started on something. So that's basically what's happening. Really chill, chill morning. You wouldn't think it was July. It's raining. Little boy is having another feed. Still on two and a half ounces, but check out this cute bib. I'm a little prince and new sleep suit. He's just rocking in his crib. He's getting a little fussy. He's getting tired. But it's five o'clock. Mm. We've just had some sensory play. A really soft teddy. stroking that on his skin and then we did we just did some tummy time for a couple minutes for the first time he was okay to begin with but he got fed up pretty quickly Gonna have a shorter nap now for an hour and then um I'll have another feed around six. And then we'll do a nighttime routine which we haven't quite got down yet, didn't do it last night. He's a whole day old now. Um we didn't do a night routine last night so this will be the first night so we're just going to figure out what works. Probably it will be change him, put him in some different clothes, maybe. Then he needs to go um We'll bring him up here, so we'll have feed and then change. And then we'll get a book and bring him up. Swaddle them all up. Read a book. Sing a lullaby. And pop him down. For bed. Or maybe we'll do that at eight. I don't know. We'll see. Because once you've done the night routine and he's in a swaddle, you have to keep talking to a minimum when he's awake. So I'll probably leave it till eight. And then we'll have another night. So we have six and eight and ten, and then it's the night time again, one and four. 
we'll see. Also, the reason this vlog will be going up on either a Monday or Tuesday rather than a Sunday like I said in my video they'd be on Sundays is because I don't have any Wi-Fi at the moment because it hasn't been transferred to our new house yet so I'll have to upload them once I have Wi-Fi gonna read you a book. We're reading The Tale of Squirrel Nutkin. Okay? The Tale of Squirrel Nutkin. This is a tale about a tale. A tale that belonged to a little red squirrel and his name was Nutkin. He had a brother called Twinkleberry and a great many cousins. They lived in a wood at the edge of a lake. In the middle of the lake there is an island covered with trees and nuts. He will throw sticks at you and stamp his feet and scold and shout K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-K-